is Victor Stewart, one of the technical instructors working with the referees program in the JFF. Our duty entails training and development of referees. What we do on a Saturday morning generally is that we have a cadre of referees who we refer to as our elite panel. These referees are responsible for performing duties at the National Premier League level. We normally focus on duties that they would perform during the course of a game. The referee has to be moving to and from in order to maintain good position and they have to be technically competent in order to make the correct decisions at all times. There are several signals and these signals are very important for the smooth running of the game. The game is officiated by a, a referee and two assistant referees coupled with a fourth official. The signal by these match officials to each other is very important in football. The coordination of these signals is very important. Basically, there are about nine signals during the course of the game that is made between the referee and the assistant referee. For example, you would have seen in the demonstration with one of our members here, there's a signal for goal kick, a signal for corner kick, a signal for throwing, there's a signal for direct free kick from the referee, indirect free kick, a signal for penalty, and from the port official, there's a signal for substitution. Thank you for Red Stripe, thanks Red Stripe, the National Premier League, and we are very grateful for that Monday night game. Can't talk to you anymore. Football is about to roll again. Let's go.